G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Draw with Jazza. I'm Jazza and this video is the announcement for the theme of the May 2016 challenge of the month. And the theme of this challenge of the month is, based on your votes, dragons versus kittens. So in this theme, participants will be required to illustrate a dramatic or comedic or cute battle between dragons and kittens. Now there's a bit of flexibility in this theme, so of course, as usual, you can uh, go traditional or digital, and like I said, you can go dramatic and epic, you can go uh, like really serious or comedic or cute. Uh, also, you don't have to do uh, an army of dragons and an army of kittens, you can have one versus one, but specifically, you need to create a depiction of a conflict between dragons and kittens. They are battling, but it can be a cute battle if you want it to be, or it can be an epic battle. I should also specify, as I know there will be questions around this, that you can depict existing dragons and kittens. So for example, if you had a battle between the dragon from Shrek and Puss in Boots, which are there from this shared universe. You can do that sort of thing, but always, always credit the original owners of the intellectual property and copyright in your fan art, essentially. That being said, while I'm allowing for that, I would encourage entrants to create their own new and unique characters and scene and depiction. So straight into the rules, the entries must be submitted to newgrounds.com via the art portal and your entry must be tagged with one of two tags either dragons v kittens all one word capitals or not capitals doesn't matter as long as dragons with an s v kittens with an s is uh, the tag that's for the open category but if you're a beginner and you're very new to art and you're just uh, you know a bit worried about jumping into the fray but you want to give it a go anyway you can tag your piece with b dash dragons v kittens. That's uh, B hyphen dragons v kittens and anything tagged with that instead of the dragons v kittens open category tag will be entered into the beginner category. You cannot enter both categories. It doesn't increase your chances. If anything, it makes me uh, consider disqualifying you entirely. So be aware of that. And you can only submit one entry. There's a maximum of one entry per person. Your entry must not be sexually inappropriate or contain nudity and must also not have gratuitous violence. But a little bit of action and even a little bit of blood is okay if that's the style of going forward, just nothing OTT. Keep it PG-13. Also, all entries to the challenge of the month must contain a work in progress picture or video. So you can link to this in the description of your final artwork submission, but don't tag your work in progress piece if you submit it to the art portal, uh, just submit it and link to it in your main piece but you can also if you want to link to uh, an image hosted on any other image hosting service such as imager uh, and you can also if you want to link to a youtube video if you create a speed painting of your image which you're of course allowed to share on your youtube or social media finally the deadline for this challenge of the month is sunday may 22nd so that's it for all the rules now let's jump into the prizes prizes are divided into the the two entry categories. So we have the beginner category and the open category. The runner up to the beginner category will receive an item of their choosing from the Jazza Studios shop, which is my personal shop, which has products like eBooks and photo reference packs, some Photoshop brushes, a video course on animation and products are expanding every year. So hopefully the winner will find something in there that they can benefit from. Uh, the first prize winner of the open category will receive a three month free membership on the Adobe Creative Cloud, as well as a signed book by Christopher Hart, the best-selling How to Draw author, and a Stillman and Burn 5.5 by 8.5 Epsilon series sketchbook with a sketch in the front page drawn on and signed by me, as well as an item of their choosing from the jazzestudios.com shop. Hashtag swag. Hashtag. <laughs> Now onto the open category. All finalists in the open category will receive a free copy of my custom Photoshop brushes. These custom Photoshop brushes were created by me for everything that I do and I use them absolutely every day and in every project. In fact, the how to draw book that I'm working on right now, which is gonna be published in America and distributed around the world, is completely being made using these Photoshop brushes. So I obviously stand by their value and recommend them if you're interested in creating 
art with an aesthetic similar to mine uh, or are interested in playing around with them. The runner up of the open category will receive a copy of the new book 21 Drawers, an art compilation book, which is very cool. So I highly recommend checking that out as well as a brand new Stillman and Burn 9 by 12 Epsilon series wirebound sketchbook with a sketch on the front page drawn on and signed by me and an item of their choosing from the jazzestudios.com shop. The overall winner of the open category and the challenge of the month as a whole will receive one year's free subscription on the Adobe Creative Cloud. This subscription gives you access to all of their industry standard amazing desktop programs such as Animate, Photoshop, Premiere, After Effects and so on. But beyond that, it also gives you unfettered access to their mobile apps, which believe it or not, are actually really cool. I've just discovered uh, Adobe Premiere Clip, which is their phone editing uh, software. And this has actually been something I've recently started using quite a lot because I started a vlog channel. Yes, you heard me right. I started a, a daily vlog channel where I post behind the scenes episodes on all of my daily activities. And I've used Adobe Premiere Clip and it's actually been really cool because I can quickly edit and throw up a vlog without much effort and it's still nice and clean. I can put on a backing track, optimize the audio, render it and upload it all from Premiere Clip. So it's definitely worth checking out the Creative Cloud because it gives you access to professional tools outside of your desktop PC as well. The first prize winner will also be receiving a Wacom Intuos Pro Medium Tablet. Wacom tablets are the best of the best digital tablets in the world in my opinion and I highly recommend the Intuos Pro as a really great middle ground for people who are either looking for some professional quality hardware to create some great artwork with or even beginners who don't quite want to stretch as far as getting a Cintiq but uh, really still want a professional quality result and experience. So I can't recommend Wacom and their products enough. Make sure to click the link on the screen and in the description to check them out. The first prize winner will also receive an item of their choosing from the jazzastudios.com shop. Finally, the runner-up and first prize winners of both the beginner and open categories will receive one year's full supporter status on Newgrounds.com. Supporter status on Newgrounds.com enables you to access the website completely ad-free and also unlocks other cool features like the ability to change your usernames, access secret content, exclusive previews, and more. Newgrounds.com has been an independent content website since 1995 and has been a supporter of thousands of independent artists around the world and has been an amazing platform for artists to kick their heels in the dirt and find an audience, work hard and create content, and uh, has been a starting place for many artists like Ego Raptor, like OniNG, and myself. We all started on Newgrounds.com and I can't recommend it enough as a community and great place to get creative, explore and enjoy content. I want to thank all my sponsors for the challenge of the month. It fills my heart to bursting that we have such amazing quality sponsors. Every single one of them have been on board for a long time and I can't recommend their products enough. And I say that sincerely because I came to most of them and asked them to be sponsors for the channel simply because I believe in their products. Good luck artists and I can't wait to see your entries. I'm actually really interested in this theme. The dragons versus kitten things will produce some interesting results. So remember you can share your artwork on social media using the hashtag dragons v kittens, same as the, the Newgrounds tag, but uh, this time you can look up other people's work in progresses and, and artworks on Twitter and Instagram for those of you who share using that hashtag. Speaking of works in progress, there's a link in the description to our Newgrounds forum thread where you can also share your works in progress, discuss ideas, so on and so forth. So that is it for this video. Uh, I know I glossed over in the middle there that I've started a vlog channel, so feel free to go check that out. It's it's an unfettered, unedited version of me, but the, the reason I started a vlog channel, which I've never really been interested in doing because I honestly have always found vlog culture a bit cringy, uh, but I, I started it because I feel like opening an access to a behind the scenes of how something like a successful YouTube channel and uh, being a working creative and artist um, would be interesting to you guys. So it's a bit of an experiment, but it's an entirely open one. In every video, I talk about what I'm doing that day, the ups and the downs of how that may have gone. And I also answer one question or discuss one comment at the end of every video from the previous video. So 
if you're interested in delving a little deeper into the whole uh, draw with Jazza and YouTube and working as a creative professional thing, uh, if you're interested in seeing how non-stop it is, but what is involved in balancing all the different plates of producing products and, and managing a YouTube channel and a community and all that stuff, hopefully you'll find that interesting. Otherwise, feel free to laugh at the fact that I own a selfie stick. That's it for now, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching and until next time, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for new content every week. If you want to support my work and get some goodies for yourself, head over to my store for archives, ebooks, digital brushes, video courses, and more. If you enjoyed this video, here's a link to some more content you might like. Draw with Jazza is proudly sponsored by Adobe. Join the creative cloud today and get loads of incredible industry standard creative tools such as Photoshop, Animate, Premiere Pro, and other apps for your computer or mobile device. That's it for now. Thanks for joining the arty party and until next time, I'll see you later.